Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back. Hey, hey, okay, so we are back with some more Sky Factory 4 for you guys. I am very excited to see how much more we can progress in the game. Um, so we did have a little uh-oh blooper um, that happened after I ended um, that you hopefully have seen. If you have not seen it, I will make sure to link that for you. Um, but to take a look, we have actually finished everything in the first advancements. Of course, the majority of it was 100% Pedro, but we definitely had other things that we contributed as well. Um, so we got diamonds, um, which is really awesome. We were able to get all of this amazing stuff. So now we have to figure out, are we gonna work on, We uh, Pedro's already kind of started a little bit of the age of enhancement. Do we wanna focus a little bit more on farming, age of power, storage, Etc. So I'm actually really excited now that we kind of got the basics and all of our basic foundational stuff that we need. I'm very excited to see what more we can do. So let's get right into it. <clears throat> hey, are you there? Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Okay, so since we have officially finished the first tab of advancements, what is next for us? Are we going to be trying to focus a little bit more on age of enhancement, farming, power, storage? Like, where where are you wanting to, like, what are you trying to dive into? Well, I'm going to build something today that you have not built before. Well, I haven't. Uh, I honestly haven't gotten this far ever in Sky Factory. The last time we played together... We definitely didn't even complete the, the the first page, so everything now is definitely new to me. Um, so, so I'll tell, I'll explain what what I'm gonna do first. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna work on is I'm gonna make uh, an emerald tree, so we have emeralds going. Oh, okay. Um, and then because we'll need that for the market too, at some point we'll probably need to buy stuff with emeralds. So it's good to have that. Okay. The, um, and then we need to work on building a smeltery. So this will be a smeltery. So you know how we have this over here, right? This uh, melter. Yeah. So think of this, but in a very large format to where we can kind of melt you know, 15 plus ambers at a time instead of only one or two or three, I guess is the max in here. Oh, wow. Okay. So that yeah. should definitely help expedite like <clears throat> metal, metal works, right? Like iron ingots and yes, stuff like that. Because okay. we need that. We need to build some weapons and I'll explain why next, because after the smeltery, <clears throat> I hate to say this cause I know you're not going to be a fan, but Oh God, what? We need to go to the nether. Um, the reason is because we need quartz. Okay. Okay. I can tell you the nether in Sky Factory is a little intimidating. If so you're saying will, it's uh... intimidating, then man, I fuck this. <laughs> so we're going to work on the smeltery so we can smelt down some good stuff. And then okay. we're going to... Build some weapons in, in the Tinker's Construct, which is this stuff here. Okay. And then we will, um, from there, we will uh, go to the Nether and get some quartz and possibly some sulfur. And um, maybe if we play our cards right, we can also get some blaze rods if we can find some blaze. Okay. That so is. There's a lot that we need to do. A lot. Yeah. First and foremost, working on. Um, a emerald uh, tree right now. So, okay. Um, is there anything that you need of me? Like, um, where actually, would be yes. a okay. so right out here where you started building? Yeah. Um, I need as much of this filled in as possible. So, so you want me to fill in this whole area? Yeah, because I'm gonna put the smell tree here. Okay. 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 I will. Aye, aye, Captain. Um, 
So I thought it would be pretty cool. Yes, it's a little cheesy, but I think it would be amazing if we could get um get like a get to the point where we're able to make like a waterfall. Okay, so you remember the castle you built me? Yes, Pedro built me a, a castle. Um, remember the castle you built me and that had the water off of the side of it? Yeah. And it's just like flowing down like super far because the castle was really high up. Yeah. That's what I was thinking for for this, like being able to do like a waterfall like that. And then we would of course add like um some gates around. Oh, can you sleep since it's starting to get dark? I do not have this area um torched up. Yeah. Um so that's kind of what I was thinking of doing. Like, and just being able to have, like, a a big area just so you can see it better. And um, it had, like, some, like, we would have it gated off so we wouldn't fall in. But to be able to see, like, a whole bunch of water just, like, flowing down into the sky, I think would be pretty sick. <clears throat> no, it's fine. We'll make it two. And then, because what my mind is, like, it would be cool if, like, we had, like, one area that's flat and then you like walk up here and it's like a workshop and then you walk up there and uh i don't know kind of like what we have here but like grander like bigger but it's okay and then i'm gonna just do it here just in case if that is something i want to do and i have the flexibility to do so plus it's a great this is a Great way to not necessarily stall, but like be productive while waiting on the other stuff to be made. Okay. Yeah. And then another cake you said, correct? Yeah, another cake. Nether cake. How many nether cakes would I need to look into to make? One. Oh, we only need one. Yeah, once you make one, then that's it. And what does a nether cake do again? Gives us the ability to travel to the nether. Is it like a food? Yeah, like it we, we eat it. And then once we teleport, then we get what's called an overworld cake. Uh, and then that's how we get back. What? <laughs> that sounds terrifying. So, wait, I would need to make two nether cakes then, right? Because you said I only need to make one, but if we have to eat the nether cake in order to get to the nether... What did I need to make two? Well, think of it like it gets set on a table and you just are able to take a bite out of it. Except every time you take a bite, nothing goes away. It just stays the exact same. Oh, okay. Oh, well, that... that ex, ex, okay, thank you. Because I'm like... If it's something we eat, mo you know, most of the time we're like, okay, we consume that. There's nothing more that we would need to do, so... That's good to know that it's like an infinite thing. Unlimited uses. Do 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 do. Okay. Um, are you super busy right now? Yes. Okay. Why? Well, couple of things. One, it's slowly starting to get dark. I don't have torches placed because I'm just trying to quickly do this. So I didn't know if you wanted to either come and place torches or if you are willing to um, just sleep. Uh, yeah, I don't have any torches on me, so I'll just sleep. I have them. Okay. That's fine. Uh, I was trying to finish this area up and then I was going to uh, place all the 
I'm Where working on making seared bricks so we can actually um, do the smeltery. Okay, that's fine. It's getting random at all animals just out of nowhere. Okay, um, and you said another cake. Okay, let's see. Another cake. There's two. Oh, this is not a portal to another dimension. Your cake is in another castle. This is food. This is not a lie. Okay, so they actually have a cake that's food. This is an the tell. Okay, so we need obsidian. So three, six, eight obsidian. Okay, so that's pretty easy. Okay, I just need to fill this. Uh, bucket up with water, and then I know we have some obsidian as well, but I don't really want to go looking for it. Especially it's since- It's in the chest. There's like three of them in there. Yeah, I know. I was just saying like- oh, Yeah, you should definitely just make some. Yeah. We definitely need to figure out water as well. Uh, I mean, we're, I mean, we're pretty good on water because we have a ton of saplings now with all these trees. I know, but it's just like the jumping and crushing it. I wish there was like a, a faster way of like. Oh yeah. That's, if that's what you want, that's fine. We could just do, um. Let's see. I have eight. Okay, perfect. And then I need to make an actual cake, which takes, um. Three buckets of milk. Okay, come here. Uh, yeah. Infinite oh, water source. Thank there you. you. You're welcome. Okay, so I need. Actually, I need the ingredients. Three buckets of milk. Two sugar. And then three wheat. Okay, so let's do the wheat first. Right. So, Miss uh, Content here, I have something that I'd like you to do if you can for me. Uh, am I able to, f like, does it need to be done ASAP? Well, that's what I'm working on, so. Okay. Yeah, can what about you, the red um, die? Can you right click on here for me? Right click where? On the cauldron. To get the water out? No, I need I, I need what to die. Oh, so you can change the color, of the water. Oh, <gasps> then uh, that's can cool. You take that sand, and can you right click on it, please, with the sand? Red sand. Yes, I need that red sand, please. How much? How many red sands do you need? Just the one. I'm gonna make a copper tree. There you go, it's over there. That's cool, I didn't know you could dye water. Yep. Okay. So we need, I said three, three wheat, um, we need sugar, so I need sugar cane. For my knowledge, it requires wheat to get that. So let's grab a bunch, and then we're going to go to the merchant. Hello, well, the market, my bad. We need um, sugar cane seeds, and your payment is eight, so thank you for that. And we're going to put the wheat there, and then the obsidian. We'll mill over to the side. And then let's go plant. Oops. 
Let's go plant our sugar cane. Did you ever figure out when you were doing the bacon tree about the sugar cane? Uh, uh what about it? Remember I was saying like this is the, as big as it gets. It doesn't fully oh, grow. Yeah. yeah. It, do you need one sugar cuz I, I had one. Yeah. There's one right in here. But if we plant the sugar cane seeds, it'll grow up to three high. You break the top two and then the then you leave the bottom. It's in the center. Mine wasn't growing three high. It will. It just takes time. Oh, but I don't got time. I'm impatient. So we're going to go back. We make the nether cake. We have everything we need. So we're going to make the cake. Oh, I'm missing an egg. Dang it. I thought you said you got an egg from yeah, the- Yeah, the furthest chest down there by the trees. There's okay. Oh, sweet. Cool. Alright. What's the difference? A cake and then a cake. The same. Okay. So, cake. And then... Another cake. Boom. Alright. So the nether cake is done. I'm okay, gonna... um, I think we should probably put it over here where there's nothing. Just so I just put it in the chest. The I just put it in the chest. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Fine. When we're ready, we'll put it down. Yeah. Uh, if, oh. you wanna, if you want to sleep. Yep. Why not? Let's just see what spawns. Okay. No. No, not at all. Okay, I'm gonna go put some torches in this area. And then, um, from there, um, as you build, you can, of course, make adjustments. I have to step away for just a minute. You're okay. I know why. I can hear. Alrighty, so I do. I really love the stair aspect. I feel like I'm gonna fall off because I'm just gonna be like, wee. Okay, I'm going to cook. Oh, he added another furnace? Jeez, I didn't even see that. Okay, right, I'm gonna cook a whole stack of 64. And then. He's using that for something. He made seared bricks. I'm not going to touch those. I'm going to borrow this top one for the sand. To have some extra uh, glass on us. Because eventually, I'm getting my waterfall. Ooh, I can actually try and play around with it. Yeah, let's actually... <laughs> let's actually grab some water. Okay, who's ready to make a mess? Heaven is. Ah, <gasps> oh, so satisfying. Oh yeah. This is this is happening. This is a hundred percent happening. It's so satisfying. <laughs> Priorities. It's so cool though, like, oh. Oops, hold on. Oh, you can't like sack those, okay. See, part of me is like, what if you just like go down? See, that's that's what I wanted. Oh, that's so sick. That's literally what I wanted to like to see. Oh, I think I fucked up on that one though. Wait, can I pull water from there? No. Okay. <laughs> it's so cool to me. I'm I'm I know it's like the I'm very easy to please. <laughs> like water and glass those are heaven's like go-to things on minecraft and of course torches because i don't have time for these things to be spawning <sighs> it's 
so satisfying. Okay. Gonna stack all those buckets. And then does it stop it? Yeah, I think so. So it's gonna like break break, huh? Yep, yeah, okay. Alrighty, so I know we were cooking a few more, so we'll just add the glass, um, where is it? So we'll add the glass around, oh wait, while I'm here, let me grab some more water. <laughs> we'll add the glass around and then, um, we will, um, kind of make it somewhat pretty, but yeah, this is... It's hard to really appreciate it from this angle, but I'm saying like, um, I can always expand out and then you can see it from the other side. And I think that's when it's gonna be like, like that wow factor. Okay. And then you can hear the water. Oh, so satisfying. Okay. So then we're gonna add the glass. It just made my pathway like hella small, but it's okay. See, so now we, you know, we're not falling. All right. I need more sand. <laughs> Where's the sand tree? Is it? So if I can at least get the water portion. <gasps> what if I made it where we, like, I do this? Nah. I was going to say, like, what if I added the stairs on this side still? And then you walk over the water. That would be, that would be kind of intense. Paige was probably like, what the hell is heaven doing? <laughs> Having fun, a hundred percent. And watch, I don't end up falling. I end up <laughs> with the water, like slowly accidentally moonwalking into the water and then, <laughs> and that's, and that, that's how heaven falls. But you know how like you can swim on the, like swim up the water? What if that is actually just a way for us not to have to uh, worry about um, falling? Who knows? Who knows? Okay. Ooh. We're almost done. Okay, so we need one, two, three, four. So we just need four more trips, but we're gonna go and sleep just on the safe side. Because yeah, I don't I don't really want anything popping up. We have like what am I gonna do with the stone axe? <laughs> like that's all that's all we got. Okay. Okay. And then we're gonna do one more. And when we do the one more, we'll come back with more glass and then we'll be able to finish it off. What? Oh. Like that's not what's supposed to happen. Oof. Okay. So then we're gonna fill the buck one more bucket up and then we're gonna grab glass um, and then finish doing the oh, oh, bottom layer bottom layer of glass and then yeah um that's gonna block the wait hold on um because i'm gonna do stairs there i mean it's i can always fix it it's not that uh yeah it's a yeah we're gonna get rid of this and then we'll do it there and there okay sick all right, so that is actually gonna wrap this video up. Uh, yeah, we're we were able to make another cake, so that's great. Um, so as Pedro said, that's gonna allow us the opportunity to go into the Nether, which we're we're totally not ready for that. Not ready for that at all. Pedro was able to make a uh, emerald tree, which is actually pretty cool. Um, and we were able to help him. 
make something. I don't even I don't even remember. We just dyed the water red and made red sand, which I don't even know what he's using that for. I think it has to do with the the smell tree. Um, and then we were able to fill in this huge area. It's actually quite big with tier two leveling and added some stone stairs around the side. And we started working on a water feature because heaven loves glass and water. Okay. Um, I, I'm really like, come with me on my vision. I think once I expand out and we're able to see it from a different direction, because from here it's like meh, but then being able to see it from like the other angle, I think it's going to look so, so cool. And then I will plan on doing another layer of glass just kind of on top of there. Um, and then who knows you, maybe I'm like, you know what? I want to make it where we can like cross um so like let's say i just end up covering this whole area like this whole like like i add glass um here and then push the glass all the way across and then um add like tier two leveling of glass which would be kind of crazy to say tier two level of glass and then you're just walking across and then it's like you see the water i think it'll be sick if like we have glass in like the whole thing is covered in glass and then you can stand in the middle and just get a full 360 of like just water like come on like this looks so cool to me like look at <gasps> Hey Pedro, are you busy? <laughs> Pedro, if you can't talk, that's fine. Can you come over to me if you can hear me? I don't know if you can hear me. Pedro, I'm literally gonna come. <laughs> so I made my water feature, but look what happens. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god I didn't think they were going to just like what the fuck that they just <laughs> that's <laughs> I, I was like oh water feature and then these poor things are spawning in and just dropping Oh, man. Well, you know, I think if we need a fish, we're we're good. But like, come on, look at how sick this is, right? So like, um, actually, let's go here. This is a little bit further out without us having it. Come on, that's so gorgeous. Ah, and then imagine if like you're able to see that like 360 and it's blocked so we don't have to worry about falling in, but that is, oh, it's so beautiful. And that's kind of what I wanted, that big square area and then just water kind of falling off like the sides. Once again, I did not uh, expect for squid to be spawning, but... I mean, if we can figure out a way of... I'm wondering if we, like, get, like, a bow and arrow and we kill them? If, like, since they drop, like, the, like, the ink, um, if that will float to the top? I don't know. But <laughs> that's gonna wrap this video up. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, feel free to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed the content. As always, guys, as, as a content creator, we do the very best that we can to provide you with entertaining content. Whether it's relaxing, expanding the base, uh, not ASMR, but Heaven mumbling to herself the majority of the time, or creating water pieces that spawn squids uh, and drops them to their demise. Um, 
We definitely uh, put a lot of time, energy, and effort into creating this content for you guys. Also, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified when the next video goes live, um, as well as a lot of the shorts. And please leave a comment. Yeah, if there's anything in Sky Factory 4 that you're like, hey, I thought this was pretty cool, or um, I'm struggling with this, can you show me how to do that? Or I've never played Sky Factory 4, but I did see that there's a diamond tree. Can you show me what that looks like or how to make one? Even if you're not gonna play the game, feel free to drop a comment down below. And uh, I tend to respond to the majority of my comments. Unless you're trolling, then I'm just kind of like, meh. Um, <laughs> but thank you guys once again so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.